This is the spare set. Picking on my wife about wearing a blanket. Why am I wearing a jacket? Oh, beautiful. Oh, and then I just, I scored on Marketplace. I got a whole box of building materials, real cheap. Galvanized nails, which I needed. Metal screws, which I needed. Bunches of them. Hangers, all kinds of things, so awesome. I love the Marketplace, finding a deal. I'm gonna set all my posts in this nice weather. Once I do that, I think I'm gonna turn my attention to my road and my driveway. Like I said last week, um, and then I'll be able to get my truck up here. I think some spots are just a little narrow. I probably could right now get it up here, but still take the mule for now until I grade everything out, make it a little smoother. All right, here we go. Another beautiful day, 65 plus. Um, running out of lumber, it's a good thing. Getting down there, got a few trim pieces, fascia boards to put up. I'll do that now. And then I'm gonna do some dirt work here, clear this out so it's a nice level spot. I've already done the dirt work on the backside and uh, we're looking pretty good. So away we go. pants ripped uh hope this video doesn't get an explicit filter on it um i ripped my pants and i tried to patch them this morning and that patch ripped so sorry about that trying to level all this stuff bring it down here and almost make like a flat area up here and then a little hill and then another flat road so i can loop around if it works. pretty good I don't know if you can tell it's relatively flat there's a little bit down here that I could add some dirt in and make it completely flat but it's the flattest I've had well if you watch my last build and then this property it's the biggest flattest place I've had on both properties probably so that's worth something but a good job got her tucked in for the night and uh she's pretty thirsty it's hot out here today so gotta fill her up boy I didn't need the cab today Last day of January. I was happy to have it most days. Oh, under five gallons today. Thought I was easily gonna empty that. All right, trip the lows. This is what I ruined on the shed when I was taking it down. Two by 12, three two by sixes. And I'm just gonna put a new ceiling on because that foam board I took out wasn't in that great of shape. So, bought a new ceiling, all total, a little over 300 bucks. So, we'll get up to the build here. I get a roof on it now. It's supposed to rain this weekend. The lumber cost me like 
50 bucks for four pieces. Might have to get a sawmill. Might be my last purchase around here for a while. Not waste so much money on such a little amount of wood. Finally, just about ready to get some metal on. I thought this week I'd have more metal on than I do. Obviously, I have zero on right now, but uh, just a lot of little things left to do. I, I finished the framing on the canopy in front and then some uh, other small pieces around the, the build. And then I was just trying to get everything square before the metal goes on as much as possible. Um, just because that's gonna really hold it all together once that metal's on. There it is, the last row on my last rafter of my nemesis, the roof and nail. Let's get rid of them. Woohoo! There we go. I mean, it's a good start. Uh, I just, my roof isn't screwed on. And here's the part I'm worried about. I'm worried about hitting these rafters with the screws coming through the roof. I've only got it tacked down in a few places right now. But now I'm gonna go back and try to find all the rafters. And if I miss, then I make a hole in my ceiling. So I don't want that. Maybe I'll put a little wire in each hole and see, see where the rafter is and try to directionalize the screw. That's the job now. I, I was thinking I was gonna get the, half done today but just like everything on this project uh it's going a little slower than i expected all right there we go i'm all buttoned up ready for that rain that's gonna fall we'll get the rest of the roof on next week and partial walls up. I'm not going to make any prediction about how much I'm going to finish next week, but after that, uh, soon I should be starting my cabin. It's going to be right over there. So if you're here for the cabin build, um, should be coming up soon. Okay. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you next time.